Hello and welcome back. Well, today we're heading to the remote Yorkshire Dales and we are going to check out the route up to Fallskill Waterfall. We're going to park up near Ribblehead Viaduct and just follow the path north until we hit the waterfall. So come and join me. Let's go. It looks like you can actually drive up to the viaduct and park underneath it, so we'll check that out. It might make getting to the waterfall if you want to have a swim a little bit easier. 1875 it is. little challenge. Oh, who doesn't love some stepping stones when I walk out? I'm on my own up here so if I fall in. I made it, made it over with a, only a slightly soggy sock. I'll take that. I don't feel like I'm talking to myself but that's okay because it's only the moors can hear me. I'm not sure whether I'm too hot or too cold. Oh, but it feels amazing. Have a look at this. I'm the only person out here for miles. Okay, more stepping stones. Which way, which way? I think this might be the point at which my other sock gets wet. What do you reckon? What's the betting it's the same sock? <laughs> the ones weaving it out and the answer was both <laughs> I've gone slightly off track and it wants me to go down here well thanks for taking a wrong turn I managed to avoid walking over the river but I now have two wet feet and a soggy bottom I think we must be Hopefully not too far off, maybe another 5-10 minutes. made it. Whew. I'm a bit warm because I ran that last bit so I'm very short on time. Um, so I'm going to walk around a little bit and do the recce. But it looks absolutely stunning. It's definitely one for a while swimming. It looks very very shallow but it looks like it might be enough to have a bit of a dunk because it's quite a high waterfall so it should be a reasonable pool where to have a swim in. Um, but sadly due to time I think I'm going to have to cut it short here. It does look amazing. I'm going to show you the bog. There we go, there's the squelchy boggy path. And you just walk around to the waterfall. There we go. I'm on my way back now. I think I've accomplished what I came for. Um, it's absolutely stunning out here. I mean, this, it was free to park your car. Admittedly, it's uh, not as accessible if you don't have a car or somebody very kind that give you a lift. I don't know if there's any bus routes around here, there might be. Um, but the price of diesel again for this. Oh, what's not to love about this? Just stuck. Look. It 
don't want to be here. This is fabulous. Oh, I'm dizzy. Oh my god, really dizzy. Definitely want to come back here. It looks amazing. Lots of picnic stops along the way. To say you don't. It's not too strenuous to walk. A bit rocky underfoot. It's not wheelchair accessible. Let's be honest. The first bit is, but once you get to the viaduct, you'd have to have some super impressive wheelchair to get up that steps. I am back at the stepping zones. <laughs> My feet are thoroughly wet now. I think I'm carrying more water than the river. But I've had a great time.